I'm Lachlan Aquilina from Scoop Property, and I'm really pleased to bring to market 41 Seventy Crescent in Hammond Park. When I met the sellers of this property, I had a really good synergy with them. After hearing their story about how the property came to be, I felt there was real merit in sitting down with Ryan and having a bit of a discussion about what was involved in getting from the literal soil to the standing beautiful home that's constructed here now. Ryan, I'm grateful for your time. Tell me, brother, what's the story? So I bought the block in 2015 with a view to raise our family here. Um, it's central to everywhere where we frequent, uh, the freeway to get to the city, yep. road, road highway to the airport, Fremantle yep. and Henderson. Cool. Um, mate, in my experience with you, um, I've learned that you have quite a meticulous attention to detail. Your house is very clean. Every time I'm here, mate, I feel like I can eat off the floor. And I feel respectfully that probably transpires through most of the things you do in your life. Um, were you involved in the construction process? Were you involved in design? Tell me, mate, how did you find your builder? What was pu putting the pieces together like? We went to a few different builders with the concept <clears throat> to suit the block. Yep. So east-west block, um, passive house concept, which most commercial builders weren't familiar with, yep. but it's basic basic uh, design changes. Sure. So basic concept, different builders. Uh, found that Dales were the best match with yep. the base plan to work from. Mm. And then the engagement with the sales rep at Dales was really good. Then we got to site, they were good to deal with, good to talk with, we're here quite often. Yep. And any concerns we had about the process were well met. Sure. And yeah, clean site, good product. Beautiful. So whilst you and your wife have lived here, I know that your family has grown a little bit larger. Has that growing family sort of fit well into the mold of what you've built here with the community and schools and the amenities and all that? What's it been like sort of since you, um, you guys purchased and you built this house? The, uh, the suburb's grown, but the community is really strong. There's a few primary schools around. Our kids go to the Catholic primary school down the road in great. Sure. Good community there with the parents, and it's 500 metres away. Yeah. There's a couple of high schools in, um, a new one coming up. Uh, it's been great for us with the block size for a professional family, mm. career orientated, yeah. with young kids, close, all the amenities are there. It's, it's been a, a, a great location to be in. Yeah, cool. Um, I spoke with you guys briefly about what the plan is from here. Um, and I believe you're sort of investing a lot of time and, and also a lot of money in, in constructing this sort of new dream home. Is that the primary motivation you think to move out of this this asset? Or yeah, definitely the uh, the new house build, which is based around our, our kids schooling, and to last them for the next you know 20 years, hopefully, to yeah. live with us there. Um, so yeah, we're building a house that's going to meet their needs as they grow older, hopefully sure. into their 20s. Yeah. Um, yeah. Otherwise, we'd, we'd stay here for sure. The community, the central location. It suits us perfectly. Mate, that's fantastic. Um, Ryan, I want you to know I'm really grateful for your time. I think that um, articulating the story about how this came together. Also, mate, I, I think again, coming from residential construction, your meticulous involvement with the builder in making sure that it's been pieced together for, for the next buyer to really love and enjoy. Um, I'm really grateful, mate, you've taken the time to share that with me. And Ryan, I'm looking forward to finding us a happy buyer. Thank you. Thanks, brother.